so you're looking right now at the interview tool, um, which they're going to be able to sort of take a select group of questions and they can add questions or reorder questions or modify questions um, so that when they send this to the admissions officers um, or alumni, uh, potentially, uh, it could be a different, obviously a different interview, but they can send this and they can add a introductory video to give either just face to the name um, or to give a little bit of I don't know, context, personality to their interactions with the admissions officers, but basically they can also add a video like this to the page in addition to their photo or name or what school they're coming from. And then of course the focus is the question. So if you just, you don't have to enter your email, but if you want, you can enter your email um, and then it will take you through each of the questions. And then you just click submit after the question, after you've answered the question, and then all of that information gets stored and is going to be available to the school liaison, the student school liaison, who will then uh, decide whether they want to edit any of the questions or answers or how they order it. And then that will be pretty much a focal point of the booth, um, along with links and virtual tours and maybe the experiences of alumni, etc. But certainly that will be the the, the, the sort of focal point of it. And of course, the students can ask, can send a follow-up interview, follow-up questions, et cetera, to the admissions officer. But this is a good opportunity for the students to decide what questions they would like to ask and get answered, or their parents would like to get asked and answered, or they could even survey their classmates and find out what questions they might want to um, ask and get answered. But this can all be done through this tool, which will store all the information It'll give the students real-time feedback as to whether the admissions officer that, I mean, they're going to email an introduction, right? They're going to send and then their link, which will have their list of questions. And then the admissions officer will answer those questions. And then the student will get the information about those questions. And then they'll be able to use that information to decorate the booth. Okay. So that's how it all works. Um, feel free to test it out. Uh, as Ms. Millard says, I would love for you to, if you have a, a, the ability to go on and give feedback on your particular college, that's great. But really what we're looking now is just that those early adopters who wants to kind of um, grab their school and uh, even if they haven't re don't want to reach out to the admissions officer before a uh, break, they could certainly uh, get their school prepped, start thinking about their questions, et cetera. All right. So please let me know if you have any questions. Thanks so much.